Before we even start this video, I hope all of you are having a very, very happy Thanksgiving. I hope you still get a chance to spend it with your family, your loved ones in a safe environment. I just want you guys all safe. I do want you to also enjoy this day. Hopefully you are. And I, you had to know I wasn't going to leave you hanging without a video. Okay. So let's jump right in because I have two things to unbox for you. Uh, one is the brand new fear of God, the knit sweater I got in. And the other one is an amazing alternative to a Nike fear of God item. You probably missed out on. Talks with TJ, aka TJ Two Shoes Chase, saying again, Happy Thanksgiving to you and your friends, your family, your loved ones. I certainly hope it's a good one for you. I know a lot of you are gonna eat. You're gonna definitely need to chill, take a nap, and relax. So hey, you can either watch this right now, the premiere, or you can just catch up on this video a little bit later on. I'm sure you'll probably binge a few uh, videos here on YouTube, Netflix, Hulu. Doesn't matter. I just want you to make sure you enjoy your day and also eat good because that's what this day is about. No, I'm just joking. This day is not about food. Uh, just keep in mind with everything that's going on in this year, also especially within the country for the US, there's still plenty to be thankful for. I know a lot of people have had a lot of ups and downs, some worse than others uh, with the play out of everything this year in 2020, but I'm sure there's something you can be thankful for, right? First off, if you have your health, that's something to certainly be thankful for. Um, if you're still able to provide for yourself way beyond your needs. So you're able like myself to still entertain the wants, things you want. We don't need them. They're just things that we want. I want you to keep that in mind. There are always those less fortunate than ourselves and they're not in that position. So we have to keep that in mind. The entitled mentality that we fall into, uh, it, it's, it's never good, right? Be grateful for what you have, learn contentment, and then work hard to get to another place if you're not there right now. So Thank you again for tuning in. Uh, if you're brand new, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the share button, all that good stuff. And this is the most like Thanksgiving-ish shirt that I had. So that's hence why I'm wearing this um, and not something that's fear of God essentials, but I do have it in. So it's actually back up there. And it is the knit sweater. Now this is my very, very first time securing 
a knit sweater by Jerry Lorenzo. So it's part of the essentials drop. And I've always seen them drop, but I just never went for them. I always went for the hoodies, maybe the crew necks, and then I finally secured a track half zip. But I said, you know what? Let me take a look at the knit sweater. And that was in big part. Uh, I won't lie because Justin Bieber is rocking it in his new uh, YouTube original video that really just shows a breakdown of his evolution. And I love that because I'm a big fan of his work. But Paul also, um, Locust and Wild Honey on that channel, he did a pickup for the knit sweater. And I love the way um, it fell, it lays, the shape. It's awesome. So I said, okay. Let me get one for myself. And I was unable to get it during the drop. I really tried. So instead I shopped on Grailed. This is my very first time ever shopping on Grailed. Uh, shout out to Wolf because that's how I knew to go there. So if you've never shopped on Grailed, it's another secondary market for you to shop for items. Uh, it does focus heavily on like vintage items, but also streetwear and then sneakers too. And they authenticate all of the items that come in, you know, when the sellers are posting those picks. So that adds a little bit of security there. And that's actually where I picked up this Fear of God Essentials Knit Sweater. So I went with the black and then it has cream, um, actually, you know, interwoven, I should say, into the sweater for Essentials. Now for the fit, I have a small, and I know I always have to give references for you guys. I'm about 131 and 132, uh, five, six, and I went with a small. I certainly could have gone with an extra small, but I like the small. It's got that perfect coziness and roomy, oversized feel to it that I really like. When I tell you it's got a nice little weight to it as well, it does. And once you put it on, you just, you just want to curl up on a couch under an additional blanket and just eat food and enjoy movies, which I'm probably going to watch Home Alone today and maybe Home Alone too, to be very true, truthful with you guys. Uh, but with this sweater, I, I need more now. I'm actually on the hunt for more. I want the raindrop. I also want one of the charcoal sweaters. So, you know, just stay tuned. If I pick them up, of course, I'll show you guys. But the alternative item that I want to show you guys. And again, this isn't thanks to Paul, but also another follower of mine on Instagram because he helped me uh, understand I needed to pull the trigger on these. So the, this pair that you're seeing right here, these pants, they're the men's French Terry tearaway pants. They're on Nike right now. The burgundy slash wine colorway is already sold out. It's very similar to my shirt. It's sold out, but they still have the black and they have the light bone. So I picked up the light bone pair and they do retail for a hundred dollars. But, um, I think right now, uh, it, Nike probably has some type of sale that's going on for, you know, the holidays for black Friday and cyber Monday. So if they run one, I would say absolutely pick these up now. In terms of sizing, I chose to go with a medium because it looked in the picture like it had a straight legged fit. And knowing that I wanted them to, you know, have that baggier look because this is a great alternative to Jerry's uh, release with Nike and Fear of God from the basketball apparel collection for 2020. And they did shock drop again on, on what was it, Tuesday? I was busy with the work presentation, so I had zero chance of copying uh, anything, but if you guys are able to cop, awesome. I went with the medium because I wanted that oversized fit. So this is a good, again, alternative to Jerry's pants. Jerry's pants retail for 200. These retail for a hundred. You still have the same aesthetic look in terms of the pants. Now they're more close, or I should say they're closer in design and style to last year's because those were fleece and these are French terry, but the material is very soft on the inside. If you look at the detail on the left thigh, you have that block logo. And it actually does have a little bit of writing right there to signify that it is that block logo, Nike sportswear uh, design or logo that they're choosing to go with right now on a lot of different items. And I'm a big fan of it. You do have the tearaway buttons that go all the way down the side and these, they are light bone too. And then at that middle button, it has the same block logo, Nike sportswear design. Uh, I love the fact that they are actually tear away because with those buttons you can choose to customize how you want the bottom hem of those pants to lay on sneakers very similar to Richie Lee's uh, cargo pants that he comes out with but you have a ripstop design on the back of the pocket and then also at the waist so I made sure to show you guys some b-roll of that there's a lot of detail that went into these pants and I think that's why it makes them a great alternative because you don't have to go up to that extra hundred dollars maybe if you don't want to or you just don't have it right we want 
to look good, we want to feel good, but we also need to be aware, you know, we can do a lot of things with our money, right? So think about it. Instead of maybe paying $200 for the, the pants um, that released by Jerry, you could also pick up these for only 100 and then you could choose to buy maybe uh, a sweatshirt and even a t-shirt from Nike, and you could probably combine that for a $200 outfit and get multiple pieces you can mix, match, and coordinate with other items in your closet. So hopefully this gives you guys a really great breakdown and look at these pants. They're certainly uh, a favorite that I just added and I would like the black ones too. So I'll probably go back for the black ones sometime, maybe not right now, but sometime in the near future. So if you guys have any questions uh, about the items, I know you always drop them below, feel free to do that. But I feel like I broke down uh, both items to show you how they fit on me. So sweater was a small, from Grailed and then the pants are a medium off of Nike. It's available right now. I hope you have a very, very happy holiday. As always, act your age, not your shoe size. Peace out.